Good evening everyone, how are you doing? Saturday night in the UK guys, just about to um, head off for a few beers, just want to do a quick video. Just wondering how things, uh, what, what you've been up to the last couple of days. Just connecting with my friends here on Facebook, see how things are going. Just want to give a few minutes if anybody comes on. I'm having a glass of wine guys, cheers okay. This is my first glass, I'm not drunk yet. <laughs> I'm off for a few um, more glasses of wine and a few more beers, um, hitting the town with my partner, for the live music as we normally do on a Saturday night. So, um, what we got on the call tonight? What are you up to guys? Let me know, are you at home, are you out and about? Are you on a few drinks? What are you up to? But anyway guys, as you can see in the chat, in the, in the header, every, um, every Tuesday night, okay, 9 o'clock UK time, I do a multiple streams of income hangout. And uh, every Thursday I do a cryptocurrency uh, hangout training, okay, that's Thursday. So Tuesday and Thursday, 9 o'clock, I'm doing two hangouts every week now, okay. Just bear that in mind and um, get that in your diaries. The link is in the... Um, in the subject here of this live feed, okay, multiple streams of income, dot online, you can register there for um, all my live hangouts. So I'm, I'm doing two a week now, guys, Tuesday and Thursday. Tuesday is quarter past nine, rather, 9.15 p.m. and Thursday is 9 p.m., okay? Just checking what we got on you. Hi, Jonah, how are you doing? Hi, Nasa, how are you doing? Hi, Rebecca, how are you doing? Yes, Rebecca, it's Saturday. What are you up to, Rebecca? Are you in with the kids? Are the kids in bed yet or what? What's happening? I'm just out, going on the way out now on my first glass of wine. Just had a few sips. And um, probably have a bottle of Prosecco in the next bar, and then I'll probably a pint of cider in the next bar, and probably finish off in the wine again. Um, we'll probably be out to about 2 o'clock in the morning as normally. Sometimes it drags on to 3 o'clock. So we don't normally go out till about, we normally go to about 9 o'clock. But uh, we're a bit late tonight, so um, we're we, we about a half hour later than normal tonight. All right, Rebecca, you've been waiting at the bridge. Okay, that's good. I'm not sure what for, but um, hope everything's well there with the kids. have been watching your videos. All the kids and the house move you've been doing. The new house move. Looks good. I'm great, Jonah. How are you doing? Where are you based, Jonah? Are you in... Um, where are you based? What part of the world are you? Hi, Mohammed. How are you doing? I'm hoping you can hear me okay guys, if my microphone is too low or too high, let me know if it's okay the sound, sometimes I get some bad sound quality sometimes, but uh, I'm just winding down for the weekend, I've been on the go all week, property wise, internet marketing wise, there's always something going on you know, so cheers guys, okay, got a glass of wine in hand, just had a few sips already, as I was saying I'm not, I'm not drunk yet, so... Hi Mohammed, how are you doing? Hi Leonardo. Oh, you're in Dubai, John. How are you doing? Okay, Dubai, all oh, right, great stuff. Looking to come to Dubai. Um, looking to come to Dubai in uh, the end of November for the Dascoin event. That's the plan anyway. So um, I haven't booked it yet, but uh, I can see how things go. That looks like an, an incredible event they got planned there for Dubai at the end of November. Uh, I think the Grand Prix is on. And they got um, uh, um, some kind of um, top of the range boat or ship where you can sort of chill out to. I think it starts about 12 o'clock midday and it's going on into the early hours of the morning. So they got something really planned out. And the Das Coin guys, yeah, the Coin Leaders guys. So I know there's a few of my guys going already to that. So um, I'm going to see how things go. And um, I've never been to Dubai, so you never, you never know. Oh, Rebecca's having a Prosecco. Great stuff, Rebecca. Enjoy that. I like, I like Prosecco as well. Okay, Jonah, just about to go to the rest, okay. Good stuff. Okay, guys, yes, yeah, so, um, hi, Noel, thanks for joining. You're having a few beers, Noel, good stuff. I only go out one night a week, guys, one night a week, sometimes... I go out in the middle of the week to be getting a, a, like some kind of networking event sometimes in the middle of the week or an afternoon event which drags on to the night, but my main night is Saturday night out. 
And then tomorrow, Sunday, we go for Sunday lunch and a few more beers tomorrow as well. But it's only normally Saturday night and Sunday afternoon. And on the odd occasion, uh, Friday night as well, you know. But not every um, Friday, just Saturday night and Sunday afternoon. Have a few beers and relax. Hi, Mark Sood. Thanks for joining. What are you up to, Mark Sood? Are you out? Are you having a drink? Are you eating? Are you at the restaurant anywhere? Or are you stuck at home? Let me know. Well, thanks for the call. It's Mark Sood this morning. Andres, how are you doing? Send me a private message, Andres. Don't jump into investing all your money in one, in one business or program, that's for sure. Let's have a sit down and talk about things. That's where a lot of people make mistakes. They stick all their money into one business or program and then something goes wrong and then their money's gone overnight, you know? So we need to sit down carefully and have a strategy in place and um, put your money into about four or five different things, at least. Spread your money very carefully. You never know what's around the corner, you know? So many things coming and going these days. No one's asking what's best, fuel coin or dust coin. Um, that's, that's, that's a 50 50 question, like two completely separate things. Everyone's got their opinion on things. But um, dust coin, obviously, is very early days. Uh, very, very early days for dust coin, but they've got big plans. And uh, I'm looking forward to them coming on an, on an exchange very shortly and getting the, uh, the real coin value of, of um, Dascoin. I'm really looking forward to that one. Obviously, fuel coin is already on an exchange. It's already two years old in the making. So you can't really compare them like for like. They're completely different things. So, um, and and they, they, they look, they, they're looking to do different things from a coin point of view as well, you know? So obviously, fuel coin is only um, one and a half cents as we speak trading at one and a half cents. So uh, I've, got t I've got over 10 grand invested in, in, in fuel coin. I got around about 6,000 euros invested in, um, in Dascoin. So um, I know for a fact, um, fuel coin point, from a fuel coin point of view, I can really see that coin progressing 5, 10, even 20 cents plus. And um, even at that level, that's going to make me very, very rich. If, if it goes up to a dollar, it's going to make me very wealthy. It's as simple as that, guys. But um, I'm on a call every day with the owner of Fuel Coin, and um, I'm really excited about that one. But give me a private, send me a private message, and arrange a call with me if you want to take that further. But at the end of the day, guys, cryptocurrency, whatever you're involved with, traffic programs, revenue shares, just spread your risk. You know, think about things. Don't put all your money to one. Them days are gone, guys, where people put all their money to one. They lost money. If anything went wrong, you know what's happened in the past. Things have gone wrong. And, um, you know, just the money's gone. Your income's lost overnight. Yes, cheers, Maxud. We'll do what we discussed earlier. Thanks for that, Maxud. No one is asking, when do I think fuel coin will go to one dollar? I wouldn't bother me if it went to one dollar in, in 2017 or even 2018 because um, that's going to put a few million dollars in my bank account if it goes to one dollar. I'm happy to see it go to 20 cents first. I'm not even looking at one dollar yet. But um, don't forget, um, no, well, um, fuel coins not an affiliate program, it's not an MLM program, so, um, but we still need to go out there and promote it, you know, talk about it, get people buying fuel coin, because um, the money's not in the affiliate commissions, the money's in the growth of the coin. Passive, inc uh, passive wealth within the growth of the coin. So um, the great thing about fuel coin is um, it's decentralized, it's not, rec it's not an MLM, so it can't be shut down, so there's nobody controlling fuel coin, so there's no worries there whatsoever about any um, SEC. You know, the SEC people in America, there's no worries of them getting involved because um, it's not an M&M or, or affiliate program. So um, I'm really excited about Fuel Coin, guys. I think it's, it's, a, it's a million dollar maker on its own. Hi, Michelle. Thanks for joining. So, yes, guys, um, keep in touch, okay? And... Um, I'm always here, Monday to Friday, 10 o'clock to 5 o'clock, 
I'm always a people. I'm a people's person. Ring me is best. I prefer to speak to people. Call me on Facebook Messenger. Ring me on my mobile. That's the best way. Or WhatsApp. And um, that's the way to build relationships. You know, get to know, like, and trust each other. Hi, Shahan. I am high on fuel coin. Okay. <laughs> I like that saying, that's a great saying. Um, Sean is saying, do you have a link for joint? There's no link for this, there's, there's no official link for Fuel Coins. Sean, but send me a private message. It's not an affiliate program, but I can send you to the exchange and you just buy the coins directly on the exchange on bitrex.com, or you can put the order through myself directly. You get a better deal if you put the order through myself, and um, rather than going straight to the uh, to the exchange. So. But um, send me a private message and I'll get a, a recording over to you from last week with the owner so you can um, dip your toe in there and get some more information on what it's all about. Just reading the chat, guys. Oh, thanks, Rebecca, for that. It's a great comp compliment. Hi, Shahan. Thanks for joining. I know well, yeah, no well, 160 euros is now up to 180 euros in two days. That's great. Small, consistent growth. That's all we want. All you got to do, guys, is follow that candle on Bittrex, and it's all in the green. The last two weeks, it's been green, 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 up and up and up with fuel coins. It's all controlled. So it's all been looked after by Gary Yona. He knows exactly what he's doing. A wealth of experience within the cryptocurrency um, space. Um, just two seconds, guys. So I have to end this now shortly. Too many questions coming through. FutureNet. Yeah, FutureNet is, is, a, is a big one for me. Um, Dan, I'm already 60 grand withdrawn in FutureNet. I'm off to the event in Poland next Friday or Saturday. The event is, I'm going out there for two nights. But that's really growing well. It's paying on five levels, Future Art Pro. It's a great traffic exchange. You know, it's paying 8% on the first, 4% on the second, 1-1-1 one, one, and one on 3, 4, and 5. So there's a massive money in those five levels. That's without the social media platform, without the matrix, without the packages there. It's Future Net, Future Art Pro has got so much going for it. I'm so glad I joined that back in March. And um, I think that's going to change a lot, of, a lot of people's lives as well, you know. So uh, Future Net and 10 ads pay. That's the other rev share I'm building. I'm about $5,000 withdrawn in 10 ads pay. There's a maximum of $250 a day withdrawal on that. So um, but that's great. It keeps it consistent and sustainable. I'm withdrawing $250 every day without fail uh, in 10 ads pay as well. I'm withdrawing around $500 a day in, um, in Future Ad Pro. So everything's going great, guys, from a, from a rev share point of view. Future Ad Pro and 10 ads pay are sort of one and two for me. So um, it's all going great. Yes, Michelle, I'm loving it as well, that's for sure. Thanks, Dean, for joining. Hi, Vincent, how are you doing? Yes, um, Sean, private message me tomorrow morning. Drop a message. I'm out for a few beers now on the way out. So uh, that's about it, guys, okay? Um, but um, just having one glass of wine to start the night. But come into my, um, I got a private group with, with regards to fuel coin, okay? I'll um, send me a private message or I'll put the link in, in the below this video. Come into the group there with regards to fuel coin. There's, all, there's lots of things going to be happening there. I tried to put a video in there earlier, but um, that didn't work because I'm actually um, in jail at the moment for Facebook. I can't post to any groups. So that's going to end next Sunday. got seven days ban. So uh, I learned my lesson again there. It's not good at all, you know. So I have to set up... Um, a second account at the moment on Facebook just to do um, videos in groups. So I'll be looking to do that tomorrow now to get a video into my fuel coin group and um, introduce myself there and take that to the next level. Um, Andres is asking, do I recommend cryptocurrency investments or better keeping on real money? No, I certainly wouldn't, I certainly wouldn't keep real money I don't keep any real money, Andres, dollars, euros, pounds. The only money I keep in my bank account is to pay my mortgage, my gas, electric, uh, gym, 
a mobile phone contract. That's the only money I keep in my bank. All the rest is in Bitcoin, it's in uh, Capricorn, it's in Fuel Coin, it's in Club Coin, it's in gold and it's in silver. All my money is tied up in, um, on obviously property as well. Um, so I got to split 33%, okay? 33% in property, 33% in cryptocurrency, and I got 33% in gold and silver. I don't keep any money at all in, the bank, in, in my bank. I think that's, a, a, actually, that's actually um, a dangerous thing to do, the way the world is going. So um, we know what's happened in Greece and um, you know Iceland and a, and a few other countries in the past where the, where the, the currency has collapsed. But I don't trust any, um, any bank account, basically. Keep all your money in Bitcoin, gold and silver. You won't go far wrong. And obviously, fuel coin. And uh, obviously, there's, there's a number of other cryptocurrencies out there. As long as you do your research, do, do your due diligence, check the owners, what they, what they got planned, and before you invest any money in, into cryptocurrency. Gold or silver, which is best? Obviously, gold is 30 pounds a gram. Silver is 15 pounds, um, 50 pence a gram. So gold is 60 times more than silver. So silver's got more chance of doubling or trebling or even quadrupling. So... I already, I already got about 30 grand worth in gold, so I'm saving more into silver now because uh, I think it's good to have a 50-50 split with gold and silver. Spread your risk, gold and silver, you need to own as much as each. Okay, Rebecca, I'll do that. Yes, Dean, get, get as many fuel coins as you can, and um, these prices are never going be, to be seen again, okay? One and a half cents. I think we've actually broken through 2,500 Satoshis in the last couple of hours. So um, this is looking really, really good. I'm really excited about fuel coins, really excited. Such, such so early days, two weeks in, it's just so excited, you know? And um, I'm really looking forward to the next um, 18 months, two and three years forward. Okay, guys, I finish off my wine. So thanks for attending, guys. And um, I'm off out now to uh, enjoy the night, put a live music and a, and a bit of a dance, meet some friends. And um, you may get another video off, another video off me later. If anything tickles my fancy, any live music I like. Or otherwise, you may make another video of me tomorrow, okay? Thanks, Noel, for that. Okay, all the best, guys. Catch you later. Cheers.